This is Sebastian Mendel Martinez for Maximum Sports, here with Bernardo of Lion King Supai, who defends his FCR title against Julian Lopez at FCR 15, February 25th. And you just got done doing a great session here. I saw you training with Felipe Lima. I think I saw you training with Machete a little bit. Uh, what's the training like here at the new All-Stars? Yeah, it's great. I train with a lot of guys like Machete, Bilal, Felipe. All these guys, they help me a lot. Uh, I have a great training camp. Yeah, so I'm looking for, forward for the fight. And how big of a difference was it for you guys, All-Stars, as a team, to move out from, let's be honest, a, a kind of small basement into this fantastic place? Yeah, it's great. Uh, we have a lot of opportunities, you know. Uh, this gym is big. We have a lot of people, a lot of fighters from different countries. Yeah, everybody's welcome. It's amazing. We have a lot of good fighters. And you're one of them, and you're becoming more of a household name here in Sweden. I feel like, you know, your fight at AK was probably, you know, sort of a breakthrough for Sweden, like established. And then you had the brave fights. Now you got the title of a title defense. Are you starting to feel more like, hey, yeah. Swedish fighter, sure, roots in Albania, but yeah, you know, we can proudly wave the, the blue and yellow around you. So Sweden is my home now. I feel amazing. Uh, yeah, I feel ho like home. You, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. So when I fight here, it's like I fight. I'm fighting in my own house. So I feel amazing, very good. And you know, I think it was in the 1700s. There was a little bit of beef between Sweden and France, and that's we're seeing some more of that now. As you have a title contender coming from France trying to snatch your title. Tell us about Julian Lopez. How much do you know about him as an opponent? Uh, I know that he's a good striker. Uh, He's a good fighter, yeah, he's going for the finish, he wants to go from the first minute, so I like this, so we have a fight, guys. Yeah. What do you think is the most dangerous part about his game? Uh, I don't know, like, I feel, uh, you know, fight is a fight, but I don't feel any danger. I mean, I feel like I'm really, really good, so I don't have to be scared of anything you understand yeah. so yeah looking forward for a good fight and i hope he's ready as well it's because i'm ready well I, he looks ready in the fights that i've seen with him so it looks like a perfect That's opponent uh your kind of style of opponent as well and i think you know i know a little bit behind the scenes that it's hard to find you an opponent a lot of guys don't want to sign the contract this guy did so we're happy for that yes. but but that also means clearly that you're you're a high-ranked guy in Europe. How far away do you think you are from the UFC? I don't think I'm very far away. I believe I need uh, maybe two more wins. Yeah. I don't know, maybe three. So I'm looking forward to make this happen. This year in FCR I want to do maybe three fights. And let's see. Maybe this year or next year. But I'm getting there soon. Well, if there's one thing that both of you seem the fans love, it's an active champion who stays taking fights and who keeps defending that belt. So be sure to tune in to Fight Club Rush 15, February 25th, where Bernardo Supai makes his first title defense against Julian Lopez. Thank you very much and good luck in the fight. Nice to see you again. Always a pleasure, man.